Hi there, I'm Gus, come on in, I'm managing New Market, come on through. Uh, here we have our lounge, uh, beautiful sunlight of course, um, all our plants, we have our little kitchen, um, and if we go, when we go through here, we have our first uh, live room, which we call our, uh, it's very bright, very splashy, a lot of hard surfaces, great for drums, uh, if you're into that kind of sound. Um, then we go into our control room here. Uh, the studio has been here since 1986. And uh, in, in the way it is now, it hasn't changed. I think the acoustics has changed a little bit. Uh, we, have, um, we have an old Harrison here, uh, which was purchased in 1986 from Neil Young. It's been recapped and maintained. Uh, this is a great sounding console, great sounding preamps. Of course, additionally, we have um, some uh, more other vintage gear, some cowl racks up here. Um, we have some, um, um, you know, we have a, a real plate, uh, EMT 140. This is the control for it there. The EMD, actually the plate actually lives in the back. Uh, you know, DBX 160, um, uh, the, the 162, the 160 is here. We got 1176s. We got some Fairchilds there. We got Auburn, some Pultex. Um, some custom DAX audio uh, compressors. Uh, we have some beautiful DAX audio valve pre's here. Um, and of course, our beloved um, Otari, which is a, a great sounding and modified um, uh, tape machine. We run DBX on it. Uh, and here we have the first digital reverb ever built, the EMT250. Um, we got that too. The moment is turned off but you can select the different settings and then you have to hit set and you get the new uh the new settings just chorus delay all sorts the remote um what else we have a custom uh a custom dex audio um main monitors let's see we have an iso booth here um we have an iso booth here which um at the moment there's some drums in it uh, but that will be one of the ISO booths we can use for when we, um, um, you know, for when we do a full band recording. Um, and then um, if we go this way here, we have, um, we have a drum room here, which we use when we want separation between, um, between the different rooms. Uh, drums, for example, and if you can have a great line of sight going into the main room over there, which we can look in a minute. And then you have another uh, window into the other booth I just showed you. Um, from here, um, we go into the main room, uh, our beloved room. The thing I love about this room that, and the most difficult thing about acoustics is to have it nice and steady, uh, and nice and um, steady all the way through. There is no peaks and, 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 um, and dips in the, uh, in the low end and the top end. It's a very even uh, acoustic um, setup here. Of course, great window into the control room. We have a beautiful Kawai um, piano at the moment, tuned at 440 sometimes, depending on the project, we put it up or down. We keep it in great, uh, great nick. It's all tuned all the time. Uh, and then through here, we have our beautiful uh, microphone lockup. I'll go in it. Uh, and we have some real gems in here. We have, of course, a beautiful U47, a U67, which is beautiful on female vocals. Um, we have a U48, which is very similar to the U47. They're both cardio, but they also have a switchable pattern, um, figure of eight and omni. And then, of course, uh, a modern uh, rib, a modern rib, a Robin ca a cardioid switchable uh, condenser. You can switch it between um, omni, um, Cardioid figure of eight. Um, we have four C12s, C12Bs. Um, one of them is in, in, uh, in service at the moment. Uh, hiding behind here, we have an RCA. Um, yes, of course, some beautiful gefels. These are absolutely amazing. We have interchangeable capsules. This is the, um, the dual capsule one, but we also have one where we can change. We have a true Omni. 
We also have a true cardioid capsule for it. We have a stereo pair of those. They sound absolutely amazing. Uh, of course, some, some, some studio um, um, must-haves, uh, 441 and 421. Um, and our back line, we got a vintage uh, Ludwig, a vintage Yamaha. Uh, we have a Juno 106. We got a bunch of amps, a uh, hand-wired Vox AC30, a gold tone. Um, we have a Gibson um, uh, acoustic. Uh, yeah, so there you go. This is New Market Studios. Thank you for watching.